I believe Black Friday is starting early, kids. Because I'm already finding some deals. Now, if you follow the channel, you know last year I kind of got in on some of the buy two batteries, get the free tool thing that Rigid was doing for Black Friday. <clears throat> kind of lamed out and didn't get all the tools I was supposed to get. They ran out of batteries. They got a new thing going right now. So I'll just show you what I ended up picking up here. This is the new, new version. They're doing the two four amp hour uh, max output. Buy these, get the free tool, or however you want to look at it. Buy the tool, get the free whatever. Blah, 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 blah. Last year, they were doing a four amp hour and a six amp hour. I believe it was 180 for that last year. Now they've gone down to the two four ampers. They've dropped the price 30 bucks. Uh, just like, no, no one pays full price for batteries because you're just a dummy if you do. But the retail full price per battery, a six amp high output lithium is 150 bucks and a four amp is 130. So it's actually, this is actually a better deal technically. So something that's interesting is I wanted this last year to get it. But anyways, this is the new version, dude. Check this thing out. Variable speed trigger off three preset max RPMs. Quick release system all the way forward. When I say all the way forward, I mean all the way forward. Plunger comes out. Drop your, with the magnets, drop your blade in. Done. Blade switch done. LED up front. Brushless. Oh, bro. I mean, I could unbox that. I guess I will in a second. It comes with a couple goodies. When I say goodies, just things to allow you to use it. So let's check them out. Um, there's better videos. Go ahead and watch those. <laughs> this is kind of cool. It's a poorly placed. Oh, it's upside down. It's a Velcro 60 grit. Sandpaper disc. How does it, you have to take? Huh, that's weird. You have to take the sandpaper off before you install. Let's install the sandpaper. Let's do this thing live on the internet. You definitely don't want to lose that. As I sit here and struggle, kind of crooked. That seems to be a bit of a challenge. Why is that so challenging for me? It's probably because I'm, I'm getting old. Like my vision ain't as good as it used to be. Oh, uh, if I had a battery, dear dear workbench, if you had a battery, where would you be? Oh, man, I could have swore I had a battery ready to go. Oh, here's one. Here we go. So. <laughs> Got a little bit of a charge. All right, so it's in the off position, speed one. Speed two. Speed three. It's kind of got a gradual start on it, doesn't it? Oops, I just about knocked the camera completely over. So it's got this button here. Let's see what this is all about. That's yeah, full lock on. Off. That's. So what I saw people talking about or showing or proclaiming or expressing that they enjoyed about this was it's essentially like a soft start, depending on what you're doing. I got that all the way forward? Nope. You got to go all the way forward with that thing. Uh. So you can kind of, is that going to, all right, so that's cool. They made it so it actually sits upside down. Nice feature. Let's put a regular blade in. Let's check this magnet out too. How... Oh yeah, that's legit. That's, that's legit. I'm not going to put it on all crooked. Let's go straight forward. Does this thing do straight? Like That seems odd to me. It doesn't appear to go perfectly straight. Is that my imagination or my 
miss miss seeing things. That looks crooked to me. Or is that like Kentucky windage so you can get in there? It's a little bit off center. Oh, it may just have been where it ended. It look a little crooked. Let's max this thing out. That is wild. You like, and it kicks into like. So like you can. Uh, interesting. Sorry, I'm just messing around with this. Very excited about this tool. Very excited. I've been, been needing it quite a bit lately, and I've been using an ancient plug-in. No light. Just, woo, challenging. I guess while we're here, we'll take a peek at the old uh, <clears throat> batteries, too, I guess. Oh, can't open that. How about some Caesars? We can open it with Caesars, can't we? I don't expect anything out of the ordinary here other than just standard batteries and probably that lame-ass charger, which, like, I mean, I get it. Come up with two bars. Two bars. I mean, four amp hour versus six amp hour, you know, whatever. Six of one half dozen the other. I'd rather I'd rather personally pay less for two four amp hours than a four and a six. I mean the six is cool, don't get me wrong. It's just I normally run just two amp hours because the two amp hour batteries. I actually I don't know about these tools. Like typically it's a if it rotates something like a like a like a saw or a grinder, you want a big battery in it or a light. I don't know if these two batteries. Like the impact drivers and stuff don't use much battery, so I love these little ones. These things are heavy. Lugging a big ass heavy battery around, it's like, geez, man. Let me, uh. So, this, the balance point is. Let's turn it off so I don't like vibrate my hand off. With the two amp hour, it's about right on the trigger, so that's almost perfectly balanced with the two amp hour. I'll throw a four on it real fast just to see how the, the balance feels. So that puts the balance like uh, right behind the trigger. So that's not bad. Pretty well balanced. I don't know. I, I was looking at the screen when I just did that. That's not a bad little unit right there. I mean, the measurements. God, I, feel, I wasn't going to do any of this crap because it's like someone else has already done all this. It's like, can I fit it in the hole that I've got to get it into? You're going to need nine, uh, 17 inches to get the blade and the thing through. You know, the width is your batteries, basically, or the tabs out here is the max. Supposedly, these are narrower. You know, someone was saying that's just about two inches-ish. So, whatever. The rest is the rest is a moot, a moot deal. So, there you go. The first of the Black Friday stuff is starting to happen. I don't, I don't know if this is actually going to be Black Friday or if it's... I don't know. We'll find out. But it's a pretty, it's a pretty good deal. Uh... Basically, you get half off, half off that, half off that, and that's a, that's, and these batteries this way is almost half off the original because, like I said, I looked it up. A six amp hour, sorry, four amp hour battery retails one thirty, so it's almost half off. You know, buy one get one. That's ah, whatever. I mean, I know those prices are, that's retail full price, and no one does it that way. But this seems to be a pretty good bargain. Um, you can do the buy the tool, return the batteries, but. It's hard to get a good deal on batteries, and no, no one's ever been like, I got too many batteries. Like, yeah, so just went with the batteries with this one. That's way too cool. Peace.